Welcome to the neighborhood. I am your host, P. Sean. We have a special edition. But before we get started, let me mention our sponsor. Drink to Shrink, really, with Salita. Lose five pounds in five days. A number is 678-548-6456. And you can also visit fruitfulwellness.squarespace.com. Now listen, we have a very special guest in the house today. Uh, he is the creator, the writer, the producer, the almost everything of the show. Please welcome Mr. Sean Xavier Smith. <laughs> hey, man. Hey, man. What's glad going? Glad to have you in the studio with us. Oh, glad to be here. Glad to be here. Okay. Okay. So we got a lot to cover, so yeah. I don't want to waste too much time and let okay. the people know exactly what's what's going on here. So, um, I'm a little bit nervous, man, because this is my boss. You oh, know man, what I mean? Hey. Uh, <laughs> you don't need to be nervous. Yeah. First question. First answer. <laughs> yeah, this should be interesting. <laughs> yeah, it should. It should. Uh, exactly what is the neighborhood? Can you explain to the people and tell them exactly what the neighborhood is? Sure. Well, the neighborhood is a collision between a talk show, a sketch comedy, and a news broadcast where you have four anchors or four reporters from four different generations given their perspective on the topics that we discuss. Okay. And on the segments and things of that nature. So, you know, I want okay. to kind of bring the uh, diversity. So, so let me ask you this. Okay. Um, how did you how did you come up with the name The Neighborhood? Well, the name came about I was at a gathering and uh, clearly it was people that wasn't from here. And they were kind of discussing everything, you know, like the culture, the music and this and that. And uh, I couldn't get a word in edgewise. It was all these people talking about Atlanta. And so when I did have a moment, I said, hey, welcome to the neighborhood. Okay. And that was the moment, you know, um, I withdrew myself from the conversation and from the event altogether to go develop Welcome to the neighborhood. So that's that's where it come from. So um, in, in saying that now, um, I know people uh, have asked like the name the name yeah. what what is that what what is the name like i'm pretty sure they want to know but what what is the name well the name is the neighborhood At like yeah you know what i'm saying yeah yeah the name is atlanta and the neighborhood so you got mm -hmm. a representing atlanta which is the capital city and um Borehood is the neighborhood, which is all the other counties gotcha. and cities gotcha. in Georgia, and we'll go just about anywhere to do an interview. And okay, you know. Yeah. Um, now I under I understand there is some big news. Yes, right. Yes, yes, big news. Uh, but before we get to the big news, okay, I've got to ask you, uh, how spit it how out? How did <laughs> you know the characters come about? And can you explain a little bit in detail uh, what the characters represent or who they are or, yeah. you know, go through go through that whole. Yeah. That whole spiel. Yeah. Sure. Well, uh, well, I've been developing the characters for years. Uh, your character, he's like the metronome of the show. He keeps the tempo kind of sort of like the uh, point guard or the quarterback on a team to kind of lead and direct everybody where they should be and where they should go. Um Decatur Slick, he's that Atlanta bred, Grady baby, born here, stay here, never going to leave here uh, type of young man mm. who's trying to find his way, uh, kind of like the hustler as well. Unc is everybody's favorite uncle. He's he's the, the life of the party. He's the one that gotcha. um, speaks kind of sort of in parables and you don't understand what he's saying uh, until you listen or hear, you know, deeply. Mm -hmm. um, Rev, I wanted a uh, pastor on the show to kind of uh, bring the word of God. Not only that, but to show balance in between a person not being so rigid, still able to have fun uh, and at the same time have balance. Uh, Harvey, which is <laughs> everybody's favorite. Y'all love Harvey. Uh, yeah. They tell you two or three people. Uh, tell you the truth and that's a drunk a old person and a child and he just happens to be two of the three okay so how um are the are the characters an extension of you like are we <laughs> you know a part of who you are yeah. in some aspect Man, form or would. shape you would ask that question uh quite honestly yes 
there is a little bit of myself in each and every one of the characters, uh, but they are also a culmination of people that I've met over the years while developing the characters. So, yes. Let, let me ask you this. Uh, you've done five episodes. We've done yes. five ep- episodes, yes, we've right? we've done five. Uh, can you think back to your favorite? Now, you, you know, on the show we do top three, top five, or, yeah, or yeah, things of yeah, that nature. Yeah. So Absolutely. can you, if at all possible. Yes, possible. Uh, yeah. Give us, give the people your top three moments. Okay, of season one. Now, is that is that is that possible to, yeah, to do? Because yeah. I know there are so many. Yeah, you're right. Uh, but what stands stands you're out right. more to you? Um, now, do I have to do this in order, or is it you know just? Yeah, 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 yeah. You could you okay. can do it. You can do it in order. Okay, you can do it in order. Um, I would have to say the introduction of everybody, the very first episode. Where uh, we first come on ah the introduction of the characters yeah good. yeah that good that whole so I tell you what like, let's 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 pause there okay okay and we'll let's let's take a look at that okay let me get you into meeting some of the people that you'll be seeing on the show first off this man is full of wisdom knowledge you'll get life's hacks I want to introduce you to the man my man Harvey. First of all, I ain't your man. Well, I ain't mean it like that, that straight. Huh? Yeah, I'm just, I'm just saying, man. That's nah, something we say. No, nah, you're gonna have to find something else to say. Don't, you don't say that. Not to me, anyway. I don't play that. <laughs> okay. You're gonna put me on okay. that tubi. My bad. A tubi what? Tubi you, you know that thing with the kids and oh, the internet oh, and stuff. Oh, like you're talking that. about uh, YouTube. Yeah, you're going on the YouTube, the website, Vimeo. All of the social media sites, man. Y'all gonna let me drink on yeah, TV? Yeah, man, you, you free. Because uh, I don't do nothing unless <laughs> I can drink me a little something, something. I can't think if yeah, I you... don't drink. <laughs> hey, look, you free on the show, man. But if you get too drunk, I'm gonna have to pull that plug because we can't have you. I'm gonna cut you off. You know what I mean? Because we can't have you, you cut whatever drunk you and... want to cut. As long as you don't cut my drink, me and you's good. Now that's straight no chaser. <laughs> oh, okay, Harvey. Welcome to the neighborhood. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah, he's a character. Now let's give it up for the hustler, the man who's all over everywhere. Give it up for Decatur Slick. That's my man. What's up, folk? Decatur, holla at me. Hey, shouty, it's beginning wood. to look a lot like wood. Follow okay. my every step. Take notes on how I cut. That's what I'm about to go in debt. Hey, Shouty, you did hey, it, man. It's just you the did first show. Like a minute into it or something, man. That's all. Hey, man, little hustle be no hustle. Every day, all man, day, Shouty. Hey, look, I'm glad you hollered at me to be a part of this show, man. You the real plug, yeah. Shouty. You the real plug. Yeah, hey, for sure. It, man. You know, you got to look out for my people. Yeah, hey, but Harvey, when the show over, man, I'm going to come through, parlay with you, man. Say you bought a little bit of that sauce, Shouty. Well, you ain't never got to <laughs> save what you never run out of. I got it. I keeps it. It's here whenever you needs it. <laughs> man, I'll let your boy keep it 100 when you do. Welcome to the neighborhood, man. <laughs> okay. All right. Last but not least, it's the spiritual counselor and advisor of the show. He keeps <laughs> us balanced. He keeps it coming with the word of God. Give it up for Rev. Talk to me, Rev. Well, the Bible says the first shall be last and the last shall be first. Let me say That's that, right. first of all, I'm honored that you want to honor God on your show, and I'm honored that you will have me on this platform. Okay. Well, you know, I was kind of nervous that you weren't going to be on here. And why not? Because when I first told you, you was ecstatic, but then you said you had to go pray, and after all of that, I was like, well, listen, when you told me that this show was about helping people, that's what made me consider it. It is a service. And whether you see it this way or not, but ministry is a service. And you're servicing people and you're giving them a platform and an opportunity and you're going to influence opportunities. I look forward to servicing you and your followers with God's word. Just know that I'm here for that and nothing else. Amen. Amen. All right. Now that the gang's all here. Rip. Hey, Rip. When y'all have communion at the church, <laughs> I was going to come over there and drink with you. Uh, you don't have to wait for communion at the church. As a matter of fact, the Bible says in what some call the Last Supper, that as often as you do, do this in remembrance oh. of me. 
Well, I guess I got one of the off days I do down pack. I, I guess now <laughs> I got to remember the remembrance part. <laughs> hey, hey, shout Hey, y'all be getting smashed at the church, shout Uh, We have grape juice. Tell me that. Juice. Oh, I was about to say, man, shout I'm coming through with John, y'all today, shout You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Pull it up <laughs> for the Lord. <laughs> well, come on anyway. I'd love to have you as my personal guest, and uh, we welcome you with open arms. I'm going to wear my jeans and boots, shawty. Uh, Come as you are. Leave as God will have you to be. <laughs> yeah yeah Woo. so so that was uh yo man okay that's that that was that was scary. Man, listen that was fun to do it was although fun to i do, was nervous was scary petrified yeah yeah i think we all yeah. i think we all did it scared yeah absolutely. Uh, absolutely i think that was a part of absolutely. Uh, the success of not knowing exactly what was going to happen right right uh, so that that was your first okay. now now give me the second one uh i had to say the sports segment oh the basket yeah yeah yep, the sports yeah the sports segment the sports yeah yeah so okay so let's 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 roll that okay now we got to go into uh now, i don't know what y'all been looking at or who you've been listening to but what the honorable julius winfield Irvin the second was the greatest basketball player to ever Bless the court. Okay. Now that's straight no chaser. It man was better than a ball than I ever will be with a bottle. <laughs> and you gotta be pretty good for me to no, say something no, like that. Shout it. Dr. J was nice, well, yeah. man. It's nice. But you know Wait, what I'm slick. Wait. Wait, he palmed that up. ball and shake move pow round and round. Oh boy, so smooth he looked like a cantaloupe. Cantaloupe? Man, that's a fruit. You mean an antelope? Cantaloupe, <laughs> antelope, all I know, he the goat. Well, uh, Harvey, I'm going to have to disagree with you. There was a young man by the name of Michael Jordan. Michael who? And now, I Jordan. know the Lord ain't told you that. <laughs> Is that in the Bible? No. Did the good book say that it shall come to pass that Michael Jeffrey Jordan would be the greatest basketball player to ever play the game? I I can't say that it does. (laughs) I know it don't. Now, read me this. Do you call the Savior the great physician? (laughs) Yes. Yes. And what's the name of this physician? Oh, his name is Jesus. <laughs> uh huh. And is the common name for a physician a doctor? Uh, <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. Indeed. Uh huh. Now, what the name Jesus start with? <laughs> Starts with a J. Well, there you have it. <laughs> Dr. J. <laughs> now bounce that around in your head and see if Sunday sermon can reflect the revelation I just gave you. <laughs> hey, Shorty. In that case, now, I keep it A all day, air day. Dominique Wilkins was that guy. Boy, Boy stop. stop. He wasn't a high, human highlight film for no reason. Shoot him up, Reb. I'm about to. <laughs> now I thought that was pretty pretty clever. Yeah, Harvey slick. Uh, how 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 Harvey, you know, uh kind of yeah. made that reference to the Bible. Yeah, he's man, pretty that, slick. That was pretty, he, that was yeah, pretty dope. He's, he's funny dude, man. Funny dude. That's crazy. Yeah. All right, so that that's two. We got two. So now now you got to give me give me a good one. Ooh. You give me a real good one for this last one. Uh I'm gonna have to say the introduction of Unk. Unk? Yeah, yeah. That was That was pretty that was pretty hilarious yeah, too. Let's, absolutely. Let's roll the clip. Okay. Hey, listen, we've got a new cast member and we want to introduce you to none other 
than Unk. Nephew, let me hold something. If you can dig it, then it's duh. What's the skinny jack lad on me? <laughs> oh, what's up, man? Glad you could Girl, be on you the show. You finally invited me, Jive Turkey. <laughs> Oh, what it do, shawty? Oh, what it does, young blood game recognized game. I see you. Oh, I see you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right on. <laughs> right on, right on. <laughs> <laughs> we are glad to have you on the show. Ah, huh? preacher man, preacher man. The good law saw fit for me to be up all in this. Hey. Hey. You got like a poodle <laughs> schnauzer mixed thing on your top lip. You better fix that before it catch a fire with that cigarette. I don't want to have to call Peter. <laughs> well, you know, nephew, it's two things I learned in life. One, houses on hills are the first <laughs> ones to get rained on, and there's going to be haters everywhere. <laughs> get your shovel, right. you dig? <laughs> Welcome to the show, Unc. You going to fit right in. Well, you know, I get in where I fit in, and if I don't fit in, I don't want to be in. Get your shovel. Nephew, let me hold some. Well, Unc, I'm going to let you hold these commercials. Woo. Yeah, man. Everybody's <laughs> All right, that favorite Unc. Unc, um, yeah. Unc brings so much. Life of the party, man. Uh, light and so much of... Uh, Funny, yeah, he's, the show. he's everybody's favorite uncle. Yeah, yeah, right. He's everybody's yeah, favorite man, uncle. That's the guy. What's what's next? Let's let's get into the big news. Uh, so so what's next for for the show? Uh, well, we have uh, entered into an agreement with Ingenious TV. We will be on the Roku streaming uh, app, uh, uh, Brilliant Minds channel, which is my channel. And uh, we'll be streaming from there and, you know. Okay. Yeah, doing big things there. Uh, future episodes. Uh, how, how um, you know, if you can, go into, you know, the future episodes. Yeah, it's ancient neighborhood secrets, man. Oh, I ain't going to spoil it. <laughs> uh, but no, go I, can, I can go there. Um, there will be some specials. Okay, that's you fair. Know, that's there fair. will be more characters displayed. More okay. sketch comedy, more uh, people involved, uh, some celebrity interviews. Wow. And, uh, yeah, we're moving along and doing big things, man. It's trying to make it, you know, bigger than what it so, already is. Uh, our listening okay. audience would um, like to know if there's uh, anything that you would like to encourage them to do, uh, if it's something you know, they want to do in mm -hmm. life or whatever gotcha. case maybe, you know, I always ask right. that when I'm interviewing people right. and, and you're going to be no less than whoever else we record. <laughs> yeah, I thought so, I was special. So we, 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 we tape. So, uh, okay. So the floor is yours, sir. Uh, Mr. Creator, director, <laughs> et cetera, et cetera. All right. Uh, the first thing I would say is to acknowledge God in all of your ways have faith, trust in him, trust the process. If you're going to do it, do it scared. Uh, nothing comes easy, but always acknowledge God. People like to say put him first, but I like to say acknowledge him first. And do it scared. Have faith and trust the process. And that's pretty much how we've grown, and that's pretty much how we plan to grow from this point on. So um, I just say just do it. Uh, Nike said it, and I'm going to repeat that. Just do it. Well, Get started. We've heard it from Mr. Smith. Uh, we are headed to the Brilliant Minds Absolutely. channel on the Ingenious TV Absolutely. network, uh, streaming on yes. Roku. So please join us for yes, that. Yes, please. please. And, um, you know, as we like to say here on the show, everybody, everybody down, here down here ain't from around ain't here. from around here. But soon as they, soon get, as here, they get here, they don't want to leave here. They don't want to leave here. This is P. Sean. Along with Mr. Sean Xavier Smith. Hey. Wishing you guys well. God bless, God bless you. you. This has been a special edition of Welcome to the Neighborhood. See y'all soon. Welcome to the